Oh, yep. Yep, fish on. Oh, got him out, I got him out. Oh my god! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! So, one of my favorite parts of fishing is the idea of finding new spots. So today, we are going to be fishing a brand new lake to me. I went on Google Maps, as per usual, when finding fishing spots, and I found this little private lake within like 15 minutes of my house. Now, I've never been to this lake, I've never fished it, I've no clue what could live in here, and that's the purpose of today's video. Today, we're gonna be finding out what fish live in here. The kayak, oh yeah, all set up right there. We're gonna be spending like three, three, four, five, something, something like that, some sort of hours out here searching for fish but yeah it's a really cool looking lake it's got like a central main lake let me get up here so you can see better and it's got like three branches one two and three so there's like three different creeks we can kind of go into and fish oh beautiful conditions for bass fishing cloudy water is not bad we did just get a bunch of rain but the water is still not bad the goal today is just to get a couple fish in the boat fishing a new lake you never know what could happen so this is this is going to be a pretty exciting video i'm going to quit talking new lake day boys new lake day it's going to be fun i love these types of days i love them let's go see launch the kayak see if we can't get on some large mouth ass boys let's go kill them here we go new mission starts now Let's freaking go. All right, what do we got? We got a jig, Texas rig, underspin, and a plopping frog. Trying to get on top water bite. Perfect conditions for them. And it's July, which has some juicy top water fishing. Oh, I just got nailed. Oh, I just got nailed. Right under me. He must have followed it out of the tree. Oh, yep. Yep, fish on. Oh. I got him out, I got him out. Oh my god! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Are you joking me? Are you joking me? Are you joking? No way. Is that a joke? Are you kidding? Let me get away from the tree. Holy shit, a moly. That's the first fish in the new lake out of the tree. I thought he was big when he started pulling down like that. And then it was just like, it's been an hour and a half without a bite. Oh. Look at that fish. That's a four. Four and a half. Mmm. That's a four pounder all freaking day. I wish I had the scale on me, I did not. I was about to brain it too. Look at that one, boys. Number freaking one, I'm proud to say that. Let's get her back into the agua. Look at that one, boys. First, first fish of the day. Let's freaking go! Oh, freaking right, boys. Maybe this is one of those lakes where it just holds biggins. Little fish, but biggins. Right out of that tree. Let's keep casting in there. I pitched way into the tree too. I can't believe I got him out so quick. That's why I'm just throwing straight 40 pound braid. No, that was another one. No, he took my bait. Dude, that was another one in the tree. Wait, what? No! 
I didn't even really get a hook set. He just pulled it away. He literally just pulled my line off. I haven't retied that rod for eight weeks. At least eight weeks. All right, we've moved on from that tree. I'm definitely going back there later in the day, though. Do not worry. We got this whole finger covert. Looks, is that a bait ball out there? I think I see a bait ball. We have this whole finger to work right here. I'm, I'm gonna go out to that bait ball. I think there's a bait ball out there. Yep, it's definitely a bait ball. I'm in the money right now. Come on, bass. Oh, see that? Oh yeah, that's bass chasing. They're darting all the way over here. Oh, see them over here. Oh, look at all the bait that is just darting right here. Oh, oh, there's a big bass chasing. Look at that wake, look at the wake, look at the wake, look at the wake. Are you joking? That wasn't me that was scaring it. There's a Mondo bass just swimming right through the middle of that bait ball. Holy wake. All right, let's try and hit this tree again. I guarantee you there's more fish in there. We just gotta be able to pull them out. Ooh, there's a nice boil back in there. Oh, that was an alpha cast. There we go. That's one. Yep. Oh, <laughs> that counts. Just a dinker. That counts. Went from a four pounder to something a four pounder could snack on. Thank you, buddy. Peace out. <laughs> it's been a grind out here, I'm not gonna lie. But we're, we're getting on a couple of fish. We got plenty of time left. That's what you get when fishing a new lake. You gotta figure it out. You never freaking know. This tree is producing a lot of fish though. That's good. This dock is looking juicy. Oh, there we go. Fish on under the dock. Dink. I had a feeling there was going to be one right under there. Oh, boat flip them. I'll wait. See you, buddy. <laughs> Psycho. Hmm. We went from a four pounder to two dinks. Interesting. Landing in three, two, one. Landing successful. All right, well, I think that's gonna call it a day for us boys out at the new lake. We were out there for a solid eight hours. Easy, six hours easy, possibly eight hours. It was a freaking grind today boys an absolute grind but that's what you get when you pick out a random spot from google maps launch your kayak there and go out the whole day and see what you can put in the boat it just shows legit fishing it happens this happens all the time with us and you can't always go out and just slam fish sometimes it's chope to a new pond catch a couple you may not catch anything whatsoever and to be quite honest with you we actually had a pretty good day we caught like a four pounder off the bat well not off the bat but the first fish was like a four pounder out of the trees flipping that was sick we had the magic tree, which literally produced almost every single one of our bites, which is ridiculous. But yeah, great time out here today. Great time on the kayaks. Keep, keep grinding, boys. Find those spots, find those fish. You will. Keep up the grind. Thanks for tuning in. I'll see you all on the next episode of Real Abronski Bassin. Peace out.